Hey, what's up, guys? Um, this video about jealousy and hate. Um, I want all you guys to ask yourself: How many of you guys that know somebody that's just very manipulating, that's hateful in heart, that hold jealousy in their heart, a person that don't like to see another person have anything in life? A person that when they hear you accomplishing um, your goals and, 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 and they see you getting ahead in life. And when you're trying to walk that walk and you talking that talk, they try to hold you back. I know all you guys heard of that, you know, old saying. If, you know, um, if I get 10 steps ahead, somebody trying to drag me back 13 steps backwards. You know, I know you guys know someone that's like that. You know, that love to get uplifted and, and love, to, love to show and love for other people to talk about their accomplishments. But when they hear about your accomplishments, you know, they don't want to hear it. They always have something negative to say when it comes to another person's accomplishments. You know, I know you guys know someone that loves to slander another person and make themselves feel good about themselves. You know, I know you guys, you know, uh, know, you know, um, someone, uh, seen someone. Uh, you know, know someone to know someone that, you know, murdered somebody or killed somebody. And I want to bring this point out, guys, that we murder people and we kill people every day, whether it's emotional content or it's physical content. We murder and we kill each other with our words and with our feelings, our thoughts, our reactions, and our emotions every day with inside our own race. So I wanted to point that out guys how you know um, we're dealing with racism right now in America around this world you know racism is it's just bad guys and we tend to hold another race accountable for you know their actions but when it comes to our own race we want to hold our own race accountable for for their actions because we want to justify um I have no idea sorry uh, excuse me guys we want to we want to hold another race accountable but we won't hold our own race accountable because we want to point the finger at the other race and you know we dealing with racism within with inside our race, with inside our, our nationality all around the world, you know, we dealing with, you know, that that racist spirit, that that racist jealousy spirit, that spirit that just that just hateful, deceitful, just lies, just very manipulating, you know, um, within our family, within our media family, you know, um. Now, everywhere we go, guys, you know, um, so it's a godly thing. It's the God within us. Some people are just very low and very little with, with, with the God within themselves. See, God dwells within inside our bodies. Our bodies is God's temple. And if we don't accept God into our hearts, into our life, then the God within us becomes very little. And the Satan within us becomes very, very, um, becomes very, um, what's the word I'm looking for? She just throws me off, guys. Become very, um, full into us. So, our ways and our actions will be will become, you know, the characteristics of Satan. 
So I wanted to point that out, guys. We all need to look in the mirror and fix ourselves up so we can be um, productive um, citizens inside this world, you know, so we can, you know, be positive peers, you know, and be real role models to each other and and, and stop putting the fingers because we all deal with this, you know, um, jealousy spirit within inside of our race, within inside of our own race, you know, of people. So, um, you know, this it's a spirit, guys, and I just want to point that out because, you know, um, this hate thing is getting out of hand, you know, this you know, pulling the thing is getting out of hand, guys, you know, and I really just want to share that. All right.